Hello, I'm Larry with Young Musicians. I'm going to take just a moment today to show you as a renter how to take down the bridge for return shipping of your instrument. When we ship the instrument to you, we usually put uh, pieces of foam that are similar to this near the bridge area to uh, keep it from harming the instrument should the bridge fall in shipping. Um, that's pretty much the way it would come to you. If you didn't keep the pieces of foam, which we hope you did, that's okay. We'll work with it. I'm going to remove this foam now and prepare to take the bridge down. First thing I'm going to do is just take some ordinary paper towel from the kitchen, put it underneath the tailpiece area so that as I take the bridge down, if the bridge fell quickly, it wouldn't allow the fine tuners to gouge the top of the instrument. At this point, I'm going to loosen the four strings and make them kind of floppy. As you can see, they're kind of floppy there, so the bridge will come out quite easily. I'm going to grab the bridge with both hands, tilt it gently, it comes right out. I'm going to take another piece of paper towel and fold it in half, or however you desire to fold it. Wrap the bridge in this. And now, put the bridge underneath the fine tuners in that same area. Move this other piece of uh, paper towel back. Then take the strings, move two to the left, to the right of the fingerboard, tighten them back up again. This will keep everything from being a little too floppy in the return shipment. So as you can see now, uh, the bridge would have been right, right about here. We have a considerable amount of area to, um, to work with. The instrument will be much less apt to be damaged on return shipping. So there you go. That's how to uh, remove your bridge. It's quite simple. We definitely encourage you to do so as you prepare your rental instrument for return to young musicians. And thank you for being a renter. Appreciate you. Bye.